today we're going to be drawing some fish from Dr. Seuss's One Fish, Two Fish, Red Fish, Blue Fish. So get ready to follow along. Start with a rainbow as big as your fist, then a swoop for a nose as big as you wish. So we're going to start with a big rainbow shape that's about as big as your fist. And then we're going to create a swoop for the nose and a swoop back. A smile, a belly, some big fins too. Make it your own, it's up to you. So now we're gonna create his chin and we're gonna come down just past that rainbow, but not too far. And we're gonna create his bottom fin. Now there's lots of different ways you can create this bottom fin, it is up to you. I'm gonna do mine with some zigzag lines. And then I'm gonna come up to the top above my rainbow and I'm gonna draw another line back. Now this part's tricky because we have to use our imagination. We have to pretend that this line goes all the way through our fish's fin and when we get to the other side, we put our marker down or our crayon down and we create that space, leaving just a little bit of space right here. A big fancy tail, so shiny and new. Don't forget his eye looking right at you. So for his tail, I'm gonna start at the end of my line right here, and I'm gonna swirl up and swirl back. And then I'm gonna come down to this one, and I'm gonna swirl down and swirl back up. So I have a big fancy tail. And then for his eye, we're gonna put another rainbow line underneath his first rainbow line. And then we're gonna draw a curve. And his eyeball looking right at us. All right. Oh, I forgot one more fin. We need his fin up here. And again, this can be as crazy as you want it to be. You just have to remember that you have to be able to cut it out. So you want some good big spaces that you'll be able to cut into. All right, there's our fish. Now paint it all pretty and cut it out too, ready to place him on some stripes with some glue. To make our stripes that our fish is going to live on, we're gonna use our brush as our stripe maker and we're gonna go across the page, all the way across, even if it runs out, and then we'll go in and fill that space in. Right in the bottom corner. 